Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Joe, aka Janelle Squire XO, and I am back with another video. And today I'm gonna to be talking about and reviewing the Coach Tabby 20s in chalk. I am gonna get into the price point, the specs, what fits in the bag, and my personal experience with this bag so let's get into it before we get started though if you are interested in beauty lifestyle and fashion videos then subscribe to my channel because it's lit over here okay I can't believe I believe so the Coach Tabby 20, I saw this bag on the internet. It was everywhere and I just knew I had to have it. I needed it. I asked for it for Christmas. I got it. So you know, I got my everyday black bag, which is the Paulin Sign Mini. If you haven't seen that review, make sure you go check it out. But I needed something that was on the lighter side, like a white, off-white cream, anything in that shade range, I needed something. I didn't have any bags, good quality bags in that shade range. So when I saw the Coach Tabby, I said, girl, I need that bag, I need that bag. So this bag is $450. The bag is made out of a polished pebble leather on the outside and has a leather lining. It has this like accordion bottom. And then when you purchase the bag, you get this shoulder strap that comes with it. You can wear it on your shoulder like this if you want, or you can carry it, you know, like this or like this, you know, just normally. Um, and then you also get a shoulder strap, which has a 21 inch drop. It is adjustable and you can wear this crossbody or shoulder bag. So lots of variety, lots of versatility, which I love. I love getting a good bang for my buck, especially when it comes to these purses because the prices be ridiculous. But this one, not so bad. Oh, I also forgot to mention that it has this gold or brass hardware. It's not really like, you know, the bright like yellow gold. It's a very muted brassy color, which I love, I love. So inside the bag, there is a zip pocket, which is where I like to put my card holders. There's um, compartments on either side of the zip pocket. You also have a little pocket in the front here. Um, or the top, I guess. And then you have another one in the front, little pocket right here, and then another pocket in the back. Plenty of little pockets to put cards and money and whatever else you need to put in here, right? So now that we've got the boring stuff out of the way, just kidding, it's not boring, it's practical stuff. But now that we've got that out of the way, what fits inside the bag? So, um, not much, <laughs> unfortunately. Not that much fits in the bag, but for the size and for what I use it for, I don't necessarily need to carry a lot in here. This is not like an everyday bag that I am just carrying with me to go run errands and stuff like that. This is more of a, I'm going on a brunch date with friends or I'm going on a dinner date with the boyfriend um, or family or something like that. You know, this is not your everyday bag where you can just throw, every this is not your everyday like Mary Poppins bag, you get me? So this is definitely more of a special occasion or like outing, you know, maybe a more casual, elevated casual type of outing. Um, so I've got inside my YSL card holder I have my AirPods, which I usually don't need when I'm going on these outings, but I just wanna show you guys what's able to fit in here. You might have to, you know, ride the subway or something and you might want your AirPods. I don't know where you live. I've got some hand sanitizer spray, lip gloss, and a travel perfume. That's really about all I usually carry in this bag. Like I said, not that much fits in here. It doesn't stretch very wide. It is not a bag that you can expect to carry your whole life in. So if that's what you're looking for, then I, you might wanna look elsewhere. If you're looking for a nice elevated casual bag that you can take with you on outings, this is your girl, okay? So like I said, I got this bag for Christmas, so it's been, what, about three months at this point, and I've been wearing this bag every single chance that I get, okay? Every chance that I get, I'm wearing this bag. If it matches the outfit, I'm wearing this bag. I'm wearing this bag, I love it. Oh, is that makeup? Did I get make? how did I get makeup on the bag? Oh gosh. Okay. So like I said, since I've been so since I've been carrying this bag with me every chance I get, it's it's kind of been through a lot, right? I've dropped the bag once or twice, 
unfortunately it's hanging off my shoulder it's hitting things it's 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 doing a lot right i'm doing a lot with the bag and i can say that it is in fantastic condition okay fantastic condition unfortunately i dropped the bag face first and i scratched the hardware on the c right here which i'm very sad about it was like my second time wearing the bag so you know don't drop your bag on concrete on the street you know maybe try not to do that <laughs> but i don't see any scratches on the bag i don't see any nicks or anything like that the threads are not pulling the bag is in great condition minus the little nicks on the hardware the bag is in excellent condition it cleans very easily like i just got some makeup on the bag and i just wiped it off with a piece of cloth and brand new i don't know if there's anything i can do about the c but you know, it's not that noticeable. You have to look really, really closely. Like you really have to be all up in my business to see the NYX on this seat, okay? But I love this bag. It's so cute. It goes with so many different outfits. It is a neutral color. And you know, obviously they have, I don't know how many, like six or seven different colors. They have black, they have canary, they have all, they have all types of colors, right? So I chose, you know, the most neutral option besides the black. And I've worn it so many times. Just a couple outfits like i've worn it so many times i love this bag it just looks so good i have the perfect shoes for it to go with i have zero complaints about this bag honestly the only thing is that it doesn't fit that much i would say that's my only con about this bag it really depends on where you're going with this bag and for what i'm doing with it i really don't need it to hold that much most of the time i wear it with just the the uh, seven inch shoulder strap I don't really wear this often. The long strap really just depends on where I'm going. You can actually buy some accessories, some different straps. So they have like a gold chain strap that you can wear. I saw this girl on YouTube shorts with it. I was like, I need me one of those. Like you can really change it up and turn it into like a, a night out, like dinner evening wear type of bag. You can also buy some like little accessories to go with it. You can buy the chain and like, there's just so many, there's so many different ways to wear this bag. I love the fact that you can detach both of the straps. So if you want to go with just the long one, you have that option. If you want to go with just the short one, you have that option. And if you want to have both options at once, you can also do that. So, you know, maybe you get tired of holding it and you just want to be able to throw it across your shoulder whenever you're going somewhere, you have that option. So I, oh, there goes my AirPods. I really love the versatility of this bag. You, you can really get a lot of wear out of this bag. You can do it, you can dress it up, you can dress it down. It is extremely versatile. So do I think it is worth the $450? Yes. Absolutely. This is affordable luxury right here. So worth the money. Like it is genuine leather. Like I said, no scratches, no, no, no scratches, no threads pulling. And I brought it with me everywhere. The only thing is that the C will get damaged if you drop it on concrete. Okay. I actually made the decision to either buy this bag or ask for it for Christmas when I saw Tanner Leatherstein's review. If you don't know who that is, you need to go watch his videos if you're interested in luxury goods, purses, bags, leather goods of the sort. You need to go watch his videos and find out which bags are actually worth the money if that is something that you are concerned about. Some people just want to buy a bag because of the name and that is fine. I have, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm. I will do the same when I have the money. Um, some people really want to know if they're going to get good value out of their bag. So I highly recommend his channel. He tore this bag apart. And I mean, literally, like he literally breaks the bag apart to test the leather and really get a go into a deep dive of how good is the quality of this bag? And is it worth the money that they're charging for it? And he gave this such a good review that I was like, oh, yeah, I need it. You sold it to me, Tanner, thank you. He sold me on the bag, coach needs to give him a bag. Like, they need to pay that man because he they he really sold it. For what you are paying, you are getting a good quality bag that is extremely versatile. Like, it's versatile on its own and it's versatile when it comes to the amount of different outfits that you can wear with it, mostly because of the color that I got. But, you know, I mean, that's really all I have to say. Like, I don't have too many other, I don't have, 
any bad things to say about this bag other than the fact that it really doesn't hold that much but that is not a huge problem to me so well, I feel like this video was really short. I think it's 100% worth the $450. I think if you are thinking about it, you should do it. It's a good investment. I love it. I've been so into Coach lately. They've really come back in a big way in the past few years. And they've just been, they've been doing a good job. In the past few months, I have gotten three Coach items. One is a vintage bag. One is this bag that I got for Christmas. And I also asked for a pair of the brown cc boots for christmas and i got those and girl i love the boots okay i cannot wait for fall to roll back around so i can really wear them like i want to not me getting a ta tanner leather scene notification as soon as i'm talking about him boy you gonna live long um so yeah i've been really loving coach lately uh they're 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 doing something over there they're really doing it over there like they're really they got me you got me. But that is it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful to you. If you have any questions, if I missed anything, ask me down in the comment section down below. I will answer you as soon as I can. And uh, don't forget to follow me on social media. My handle is at JanelleSquireXO. All the information will be in the description box down below. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.